Hi, my name is Cody Miller. I'm with the Precision Farming Division at Swiderski Equipment. Today we're going to be going over how to import and set up your grower farm field structure for your Gen 3 2020. Okay, let's get started with adding our grower farm field structure to our Gen 3 2020. So in the bottom right, you're going to hit the setup button. And then on this screen, the top left is going to be our, our field. So in order to add a field, we have to have a client, a farm, and a field. So we're going to go ahead and add a client here. So we're going to add a new one at the bottom. If you have one in here, you can pick one of the existing ones. But on the bottom left, we're going to hit add new client. And we're just going to type in Swiderski. So now that that is in there, we can click on Swiderski. And then it's going to ask us for what farm because we didn't have any in there. So once again, we're going to add a new farm here. And we're just going to call it SEI. So we're going to hit enter. And then once we have the farm in there, we can click on farm. And then we can add all of our fields into here. So we can do SEI1 or whatever your names are that you have for your farm. So we're going to click on that. And then once that's in here, we can add um, our different prescriptions if we need to, boundary files, anything like that. But in order to make it actually active, you have to actually click this Make Active button. So once that is clicked, it will show you on the top left that we are in that SEI1 field and we should be ready to plant. If you have any questions about what we covered today, you can contact myself or one of our team members with the Precision Farming Division at Swiderski Equipment. Or else you can visit us at SwiderskiEquipment.com. 